On behalf of Molly and Jeff, we would like to welcome all the friends and family who are gathered here today. Many of you have traveled from long distances to be here, and Molly and Jeff feel both lucky and blessed. Lucky and blessed. Many of you saw that shining on the marquee out front. A common phrase that both Jeff and Molly share with one another. Hello everyone. My name is Colleen Connaughton. I am Molly's youngest sister. I'm younger than her by 10 years. So this age gap creates an interesting dynamic between us. Although we are the bookend kids of our family, we still have a close relationship. I can remember creating dance routines in the kitchen, one of which you will probably see later tonight, <laughs> and watching Golden Girls and Newsies during sleepovers on the pullout couch. We rented mopeds together with our brother Patrick, cruising the Myrtle Beach boardwalk, sang along to a 98 Degrees throwback concert a few summers later, <laughs> and watched Jaws in a Texas lake after dark. It's an interesting experience. <laughs> it was very refreshing to watch these two prepare for this day. Neither of them were consumed by the logistics of just a wedding or planning for a party, but rather they were focused on each other. They were focused on the boys, Jeffrey and Aaron. They were focused on their families and their long-term goals in their marriage. Family is key to both Molly and Jeff, both with the family they are creating today with Jeffrey and Aaron, along with both of their extended families. They are so grateful for the love and support from both sides of their family and friends from Oklahoma to Ohio, and Michigan to Hamilton. Many times the wedding vows can get lost very quickly with all the wedding day details. However, that is not the foundation for which Molly and Jeff are building a life together. They, we talked about it in planning with, for the wedding and they want the structure to be based on respect, trust, of course, family, financial responsibility, communication, friends, faith, hope, and love. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. I'm so happy that you found Jeff. He's a natural addition to our family and you two make a great couple. Thank you both for asking me to stand up with you. I can't wait to see where life leads you together. Cheers to Molly and Jeff. I, Jeff, take you, Molly, to be my wife. I promise to love you unconditionally and be your true partner. I'll spend the rest of my life with you and will always be by your side. I'll take care of you always. I vow to be your primary. I promise to always check the house when you hear noises at night, <laughs> take care of you when you're sick or hurt or just feeling dramatic, and cook dinner for you and with you, even on the grill, even in the wind-driven freezing rain. I'll be calm and supportive, even as you change your mind a lot. I promise that I will listen to your problems and share in your celebrations. I will build a life with you and spend the rest of my life 
making you the happiest woman as you've already made me the happiest man. I vow to pray for you and with you and lead a life that shows my commitment to you as a husband and a partner. I, Molly, take you, Jeff, to be my husband. I promise to love you, honor you, and be true to you in good times and in bad. I vow to always be your primary, to always be on your team, and to cheer you on in whatever you face. I promise to love and help raise your boys like they're my own. I will do my very best not to get us lost when you drive, <laughs> to give you grace in the mornings when you first wake up, and to work on improving my sous chef skills. I will be your partner for life, always putting us before me. I will build a family with you and make a life with you. I commit to a lifetime of canceling each other out in most elections. <laughs> um, only grilling with charcoal, rooting for Oklahoma State football, and starting every meal with our love, our life toast. I, pro I vow to be your partner and your best friend wherever life will take us. Thank you both for including the whole Wallace clan in your special day, or as Molly would call it, a holiday. We're excited to watch you as you start this new journey as a family of four and look forward to many more memories. Cheers to newlyweds, Jeff and Molly. Jeff's always been there for me in so many different ways. I mean, he's taught me so many different things. Um, coping mechanisms, uh, you know, in life. Um, identifying uh, things that you can control and things that you can't control. Um, He's really been instrumental in my life, and uh, you know he is a brother to me, and I love him very much. And I feel honored that you've had me you know, for uh, your best man, and you had me up here for this. So I appreciate that very much. Um, I don't know you very well, Molly, but from what I do uh, know of you, I, I respect you highly. Um, I look up to you, um, just your professionalism, and. Uh, um, just you, the love that you have that, that you're you know freely giving and, I, and it, it, from what I've met from your whole family it's been the same and uh, I know that there's going to be lots of good memories and, and times you know, ahead so thank you very much and I love you guys by the power vested in me by the state of Ohio I now pronounce you husband and wife you may now show how lucky and blessed you both really are. Kiss your bride. It is my pleasure to present to you for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Molly and Jeff Teslowitz.